Hey, what is going on guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Upper Comedy back with another Dokkan battle video. So yesterday in my global thank you celebration preview video, I said that there was a very good chance that global can expect another legendary campaign for this upcoming celebration, mainly because it's just been a really freaking long time since we got one, we're definitely overdue for one. And JP actually got the Int LR Vegeta legendary campaign for their Golden Week celebration. And since the global thank you celebration is just going to be a combination of the Golden Week celebration and the Tanabata celebration, I just felt like it made sense, right? Well, today we got some further confirmation of that theory courtesy of the one and only Kawhi on Twitter. And as you can see, earlier this morning, he tweeted out this tweet, I guess, and it says, oh, it was actually last night. <laughs> Damn, I'm super late to this one. My bad, guys. Anyways, it says, chances are the legendary Trunks LR campaign will arrive on the global around November 10th. The event will be unavailable on this date along with Boss Rush and also the Dokkan events that we know for a fact are getting new stages because of the upcoming Trunks and Zamasu Dual Dokkan Fest, right? So I think this is a pretty clear indication that we are in fact finally getting the AGL LR Trunks Legendary Campaign. Like I said, super, super overdue, but definitely welcome. And of course, nothing is 100% confirmed until it's officially announced in game, but Kawhi is very rarely wrong about these things. And the fact that the event is going away for a little while is a pretty clear sign. So I would say there's a 95 to 99% chance that the AGL LR Trunks Legendary Campaign is happening. And if that is in fact the case, then I think it makes sense for you guys to be fully prepared and ready to go once it officially drops, right? So what we're gonna do right now is pop over to the Dokkan Wiki and see how things went down on JP when they got this campaign, all right? So here's the image for the Legendary Campaign with the LR Trunks. And I'm gonna read this little paragraph here real quick for you guys. So it says, Dokkan Awaken Trunks Bracket team, bracket future into an LR, complete special missions to get awesome rewards, legendary challenge campaign now available, challenge the prime battle, protector of future peace for a chance to recruit, return to the future, trunks teen future, collect awakening medals, and token awaken trunks teen future successfully or successively to an LR while aiming for or to, while aim for reaching super attack level 20 and fully activating his hidden potential at the same time. In addition, the special missions for this campaign will be available to complete the missions to get awesome rewards. Grab the chance to get a hold of legendary power. So obviously not the perfect translation there, but it gets the point across. Essentially, just like any other legendary campaign, you're trying to fully awaken, fully farm out the featured Prime Battle LR, and you will be getting a lot of awesome rewards for that, all right? So let's check out these rewards. Okay, so first things first, for people that already got LR Trunks done before the campaign starts, you will be getting a bonus of 10 Dragon Stones, 3 Elder Kai's, and 2 Reversal Medals. And before anybody freaks out about this, I think it's very, very well deserved, all right? Because it is a huge, huge pain in the ass to farm this event out, all right, without um, any bonuses, which is what people who did this grind before the campaign started had to go through. And I was one of those people, and it took me like six hours to get it done, to get all the dupes, get all the medals, and I think we deserve it, all right? So for anybody that put in the extra work to get this done before the campaign, we're getting 10 stones, we're getting three Kai's, we're getting two reversal medals, and we definitely earned it, all right? So that's a nice little bonus right there. And then for everybody else, when you token awaken the trunks to LR status, you'll get 20 dragon stones. When you get into SA20, you get seven elder Kai's. And then when you get into 100% in the hidden potential system, you basically get all of your AGL orbs back. So he's essentially a free rainbow. You just gotta use the orbs first and then they give them back to you. So uh, those are the main rewards for this campaign. 20 stones, 7 Kai's, and all those AGL orbs. And for the rest of the campaign, so the actual event for the Trunks, um, the Prime Battle Trunks, is going to be available every single day, of course, and also requires half stamina during the campaign period. 
And also, there's going to be two bonus categories for extra drops. There's the uh, Androids category, as well as, I want to say Future Saga, but I could be wrong. Give me one sec, guys. So it's the Future Saga and Androids categories that will be giving you extra drops. And let's go back to the main event page now. Next up is additional availability for Super Strike events, presumably for the characters that fit in those two categories. And last but not least, we have the AGL Hidden Potential event that will be available every single day during the campaign period for people who are low on AGL orbs and can't rainbow him. That's your chance to get more orbs. And uh, even if you already have enough orbs to rainbow your trunks, I mean, it still makes sense to do it every day just for extra orbs, right? So that's a thing. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Those were all the details for the... LR Trunks Legendary Campaign on JP, and I do expect it to be pretty much exactly the same when it comes to global um, on or around the 10th. So yeah guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Hope you guys are excited for finally another Legendary Campaign um, on global. We're still missing obviously the Int LR Vegeta one. We're still missing LR Vegeta Blue, which I don't expect anytime soon because JP literally just got it, but um, this is a step in the right direction, right? We're making progress, so that's always a good thing. And of course, shout out to Kawhi for the little um, news update, I guess, on Twitter. And that's going to do it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys found it useful in some way. As always, if you guys liked the video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you'll like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it, guys. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.